Solo por el hecho de, de haber ganado. I don't think that having won the last game will have an effect on what happens on the pitch tomorrow. But emotionally, it's very good for us. Even more so because before that, we had six previous games without victories. But it won't give us any advantage when it comes to the result of the game. We must be intense, aggressive and have the same amount or more attitude than them. We must apply all of our football skills. En actitud y luego debemos de aportar todos los recursos futbolísticos que tenemos. Me parece un equipo muy completo. Un equipo I que think they're a very good team. They dominate key aspects of the game like transitions and set pieces. They have an aggressive and direct style. I like them. It's very nice to see them play. They think and act as a group, both in attack and defense. I like them. Una idea de grupo, una idea de, de qué cosas tiene que hacer un equipo, 11 jugadores, tanto en ataque como en defensa, y a mí particularmente me gusta. La verdad es que lo veo muy bien. I see him doing very well. He's doing a fantastic job, helping us a lot both in attack and defense. This is his first season, and it's always very difficult to adapt when you've just arrived. I truly see him in good shape. I'm sure he'll score lots of goals because he's a scorer and has proved it throughout his career. Y lo ha demostrado a lo largo de toda su carrera. Yo siempre he declarado que el mejor jugador ya no solo de I've said many times that the best player of all time is Leo Messi. I've always said that. I have no doubts about it. Cristiano Ronaldo is a good player, a top one, but when it comes to football skills, I think he's below Leo. No hay ninguna duda. Cristiano Ronaldo sí que es un jugador evidentemente un top, un número uno, pero futbolísticamente creo que está por por debajo de Leo.